right now, the thing I'm concerned about is Alliance has a ton of push for this early mid game. Moving into Nisha, but he should go high ground first. So. Nisha's Nisha gone into the corner here, actually. This may have been a mistake. Tiger might be able to hold him. He's got the roll through. He'll slow him down. They move across. The curse comes out. The stun gets dodged, but Nisha, he's a slow, slow boy, and he's a dead one too. First blood gets drawn, and Mikke picks it up. They've also got heroes that want to stand in front of towers, and that just sums up pretty well with Samurai. Meanwhile, mid, Nisha, they roll and they hit the stun. They're going to block him out. And it looks like he should fall the fairy fire, the sticks, everything to try and keep him alive. One more hit, Mike oh gets it. Wait for gets hit by the frostbite. They can't really move across though. Oh, Rue straight away. Katzel needs to be careful. The Christian overcome equipment he needs to keep running away. Patos on his way across. Brings the bear back. The stomp has to be used. And Mika gonna slow him down, moving across. No Patos. Do they want to go for the stun? They should be able to. In fact, they don't even need it. The root coming out again. Quick for RNG goes his way. Well, he didn't max Spirit Lance, so he's not gonna have that opportunity. They di they're diving for Insaney here. Katzel just went under the tower. Should have went. Top gang through. So is going to pursue. They've got the Icarus dive available. Though. Can they get it out? Yes, they can. Insania. He's just buying time. Yeah. He knows his fate is sealed. They'll get him with the Crystal Nova. As you don't really care about his dots once you have the. Yeah. They're trying to go and quick for in the bot lane. They're able to find him as well. They move forward. The Dolph gang up to the high ground. Yeah, They'll finish mid. him off. Nisha. He more mid. Nisha in return will fall. They even use the supernova to ensure it. Insania. They use. Oh, uh, go in the bot. They want to get Insania here. And it looks like it's going to be silenced up. The stun through just to put Exotic D off the chase, but it won't. He'll move through anyway. Tiger trying to hold him up here. Silence coming out. Slurf's going to hit. Exotic D taking a lot of damage. Can they kill him off quick enough? It's going to be the question. He's got the double gang trying to reach the high ground. The roll through. It's going to slow him down. It's going to be close. No, he ends up on the low ground. The RNG is not in his favor here. So they take another favorable trade. Uh, there are ways of different, like... Oh, Stampede. They're go. chasing on the bear. The Gale comes out as well. They jump forward for the stomp out. Tiger can he Dying drop this globe well. science use as he blinks in. He'll be fine though. On the back foot, the BKB from Boxy. The Dragon Tail going out on Nisha. They'll fear him up. They don't want him to get oh, the poison over off or at least not in a good place. He's low on HP. Insane is soaring in. He's not using the supernova though. Pados gets stunned out as well. The BKB coming on Nisha. He'll finally throw out the poison over. And Boxy, they wait for the BKB to end. The Sun Ray's not going to save him. They go to work. Mike trying to shred through Pados. But it's taking so long, he'll finally drop. Mike trying to move away, has to use the yours. It's going to be close, but Elder Sash is waiting for him when he comes down. The stun from the egg will not connect on anyone, but they should be able to get out. It's going to be close. The Sun Ray will protect from Insania. And they might even keep the bear alive. It's going to be close, but it looks like it will fall. He has to deny himself in the meantime on that Latrak. And Insania will still be chased down. It's going to be a four for one in the end. They might even find the fifth. No, Quick fell a little bit too far away. Roll out, something like that. If they yeah, delay it by a few seconds, Insania will yeah. be up in time. The Stomp coming out, they find Mike. He's got the BKB available, he needs to throw it out. We will finally use it, and now he just needs to retreat. They're very tanky on the side of new guys. Charging up, Zodiac thinks about going in, but it's getting away by Boxy. Goes around the back, looking on Tiger instead. The BKB coming up, Zodiac deal. We have to stand his ground, they'll charge forward on the Boxy. The defuse will force the BKB out from Boxy instantly, as he'll TP out, but not before losing half his HP. Built in BKB on the um, Battle Cry. So that's quite good for them. We'll jump forward. Nisha. They're looking on Nisha here. He gets the poison over out though, and it hits yeah, on the two. It. Tiger and Mike. Mike gonna look to move away slowly. Tiger's gonna go the fast way out the yours as well, but they'll be able to catch up to him. The battle way, roll out. He'll be able to find the escape, but no. Exotic to chase him through. Me on the other side of the fight. The yours gonna count. Mike stands to fight. So find the corner capsule, and suddenly Nisha does not want to fight. But Exotic here does. Quickfa might be forced here, but the fear coming out. That, that's that's definitely Boxy. Rush they ping him out. They know about the Shadow Blade. Links forward, Dragon Tail going in, looking for this going deep. BKB not coming out of time, he's stunned up, he's a little bit trouble. Global size, well, Boxy, it's too late for a BKB. The Supernova in the back, but Castle just trying to go through this. The egg is just going to get popped. Oh, and Radiant now they're chasing through for more. They're going to find Tiger Rune on the spot with the Frostbite, they'll get him as well. And Boxy, the what the fifth. hell was that? At least your bear gets in and starts ratting, but this just feels like a huge blundle from Alliance. Maybe they get Rexus, man. Alliance. Classic. Classic. The Alliance right. Classic. And it looks like the Moonwave, the Roche Pit. Mike forces them out. He has the BKB and TP to safety here. His cat uses the freezer field as well. Far from the fight. And now Crystal Maiden. Like this Crystal Maiden can take down that egg alone. She has plus 250 attack speed. And now on your high ground, Shadow Blade up on Boxy, but what can you do? Go straight for Cat. Still gonna stun him up the Dragon Tail. The hoof stop hit on the two though. Mike didn't get the BKB out of time. The Sunray trying to keep Boxy life's gonna be good enough, but the charge before the looking for more. The global science coming up. The Yules gets forced out into Mike. And they might have to reset here. Exotic Deer doesn't want to have to leave though. The stun will hit and now he might be forced to do this. A supernova going down. The egg is good. They can't actually deal with it quick enough. Cattle's trying. Will they get it? No, it goes pop. They stun him perfectly in time. And Exotic Deer a little bit deep here. Boxy looking to go forward. The supernova finally coming out. Nisha protected by the air on this. The Exotic Deer. Aegis does get popped. Nisha might be next to fall. He can't stand against this. They lose the centaur as well. And Exotic Deer is back up ready to fight. But surrounded on all sides. The double anger up. Gonna go for the killing tiger. The Yules buying time. And it looks like they may defend it in. Perfect style as they'll get the entire side of new guys.
Yeah, I'm, I'm done. I'm done. Just so much for that, so much for that prediction. So, yeah, they can't so do anything. So much for the prediction right? that they don't get him, so he doesn't really. It's kind of alright. Oxy move four. Blink comes out. Nisha gets hit by the stun in return. The abyssal going on the MK. He hasn't used the BKB yet. The BKB gets forced down the box. He's surrounded on all sides by Exotic Deer. The magic damage doing a lot of work. Gonna chase the right. A wrong PL illusion here. Exotic is going to make a scam on the other side. The poison over coming up for Nisha. The L just to protect in the meantime. They might have to turn around and fight him. Regardless of this, the bear doing a lot of damage. But Exotic Deer goes Heal back in. The Sunray doing so much. The hex on the back foot. Cattle. He's got the freezing field. Will he use it though? He hasn't actually thrown it out yet. The L needs to try and protect him. The bear just trying to do what he can. The stun as well. Cattle no freeze and feel for you, and suddenly stuns count on Mikkei. The BKB's ran out, the ultimate by the way, time exotic deer with the BKB is absolutely fine to stand it. Surrounded on all sides, he's gonna try and fight, but no, he gets stunned up and killed off. They get everyone because Patos won't make it out either. He'll at least find the kill on to this bird, but he won't be getting out himself. And that is a row standing right next to where they just fought. This PL man, these illusions. But yeah, the problem is he is focused wholly. He has to commit to killing this bear each time or try. Which means Boxy could make this move in the top. Look, you have to instantly move across. So the moment you look a little bit weaker on the lanes, you get in trouble. The head's coming yeah, out because Boxy board. might be in trouble himself. The damage is pretty big here. The Abyssal as well. The Global Stars, no chance gets the BKB off. Finally throws it out, but it's too late. He's too low. And suddenly the bear goes in though. That's one Rax and the bear will fall, but... You know what? It's worth it. Dragonite dies. You get another Global Science coming out, trying to charge for the BKB forced out and insane. He should be able to move away there. He's got the dive in 10 dive. seconds. There's got a damage dive. coming up from Exotic Deer here. I don't think he's going to be able to use the egg here. It wouldn't matter. You lose a couple of 4v5 fights because of the rat, and then you fall apart. Okay, I guess where Katzel was wrong. They'll stun him through finally. They'll be able to prop out on this, but now they shouldn't be able to kill him. The Hex coming out. The BKB used. Stampede forward. Crossfire out. Patos arrives. The BKB in time for Mike though. No, instantly. The lowest and the Abyss will return on an exotic deer. They'll finally come to Katzel still. The bear getting low though. We'll have to give his life in. The poison never thrown out as well. They'll catch on the tiger. Mike on the other side of the fight. Yules up in the air, but when he comes down, he's surrounded, and these are not friendly individuals. Oh, exotic deer would be perfect. They have no hexes. Nothing like that. They have the stun on DK. Cool. Boxy cool. reveals Katzel walking through the Dragon Tail coming out to find Katzel. The Global Stars coming out return. The BKB is by Katzel. The poison never goes down. Boxy needs to get out. It's taking a lot of damage. The Yule's on the target in the meantime. The actually on the backside, Patos looks like they might find Insane. He didn't get the egg off in time. He needs to soar away. Will he actually finally use it? Throw it down. The Super Nova does off. come out. Patos, he's going to get stunned up. The Hex in return to the box. He's taking a lot of damage. The egg. It's lasted so long. Quaifer will just turn around the exotic deal. They'll get him though. They'll trick through him. Boxy survives with the Sunray. The buyback comes out on the center instantly. But suddenly, new guys. First one to be picked up is on new guys' side. Gotta get Jumping in, bear goes again, Glyph gets forced out, Stampede coming out, Tiger tries to roll, but it gets blocked, stun in return, and now the global silence being used, but Tiger protecting the air, the Very second stuck. global silence, but Ella Sash, he went deep for this, can they find anything, they'll find the kill of the Tiger, and they'll chase for more, the Hex coming up, Mike will get the BKB, you're looking to turn around, stun gets connected on the castle, the Aeon Disc does get procced, and Boxy, what can he do with the Supernova in the middle of the fight, they have to deal with this, they all turn and start fighting, they're it. gonna go in deeper, the bear trying to do his work here, but looks like Boxy's getting a live return, this time's really solid near good, they may be able to find him on their back foot though, Nietzsche being chased by the bear. Mike gonna get low, he will get popped. Exotic Deer, so damn tanky. Boxy, he needs to learn how to actually tank up damage. And for Dragon Knight, that's a sad reality to realize. As he's surrounded and left behind, Quickfoot does not want to fight anymore. But Boxy won't have a choice in the matter. Exotic Deer, triple kill for him. And he saves his team's base. Good job on catching this bear out. There's I think it's always someone. The Boxy in the ball lane. Global Science comes out, but guess what? Mikkei wants to join in the fight. There's two down from the light, and there's a lot more from the side of new guys. The Global Science going up, Poison Nova as well. Box is going to get low. Already under half HP, he's just going to disappear, but Mikkei as well. The Yules will not protect him. They may have made a fatal error here. Long Druid, going straight down oh, mid. Bling, Tiger. Oh, he's just remnant him up and sent him in. Patos is deep in the base. This man works against him in the end. And I'll fire as well. He can't really do anything. Got to stop by his surrounded. They'll find him. They do get the tower, but they lose their important initiation tool. And while that's happening, quick fight, he just took one of the tier 4s. That, that's true. I completely agree, but it still messes up his... Tiger. Tiger. Egg stop. Mistakes have been made. Another fight as well. The global stars to ensure Tiger falls here. But this is reaching some next levels right here. BKB. 
He's on the high ground. The stomp coming up. Patel missed the mark. Mikke has forced to use the BKB. Foxy went for the back line. Insane he uses his own BKB. He's got the supernova. Is he going to use Mikke with the oldest? Depending on the meantime, the global star's coming up. Look at him move forward. They want Mikke, and it looks like he's going to fall. On the back foot, though, Insane he doesn't even use the egg. He just dies. And the buyback from Tiger achieving nothing. They're actually going back to the base because Quaifa, he's coming for the prone again. He's going to get the second tier four. And once again, he forces them away. We had a TP back to base. Can he defend against the Zogdir on his own? They might be able to. Lift's going to buy time. Zogdir has to leave, surely. Stun up the bear, though. They jump in. Boxy going for this exotic deer. Not threatening too much right now, Quaifa. This allow on him in a little bit of trouble here, but he is pretty tanky. Refresher goes out. The bear comes out to fight as well. He's got it there. He wants these racks so badly, but he needs to be careful. Mm. He has got the buyback, but is it worth committing here? I, this I is the best should, opportunity should, to win. They should connect to him. They should all go right here, right now. They should push high ground. They're going. They TB's They're coming in. Niche has arrived as well. Elsash here as well. They're going to go for the tier fours. They're being boxing. Shadow Bladed up with Silver Rich, but what can he do? They find him. They stomp onto him. He's going to fall by the looks. He's getting way too low. The BKB from Elsash chasing on a Quake before. So the BKB out. The Bear's going to fall. Quake for can't do anything else. And they've done it. GG gets cool. New guys. It took them a hell of a lot longer than they expected. But they managed to take game one. Secures Mikke's Invoker. I feel like you need Exhort. You need more damage, right? Mid. He's making his boost. Nisha. Nisha comes through. There's the cold snap and the sun strike. They'll clean him up. Picked off by Boxy in the mid going as well. Tiger. Chase through Nisha. Can they get him? One more hit. He's going to salve up. He should be fine. He's got the light strike right. He can turn around the foot kill on the Tiger maybe. There's the use of the light strike gray going out. And Nisha gets the kill. He, does, he gets the call on top. PL solo. Oh, it's on here. One more hit will do it. And why is he going back on? I mean, I know he has no regen. Maybe it's just worth waiting because if there's any hero you don't want to be giving that goal to, it's him. And Insane in the bot lane gets hit by the Slimming Crush. Tries to soar away, but the Icarus dive will not save him. Yeah, this is hard. Maybe with the Slards are wrapping around. And no oh, jumping in. Insane spots the gank attempt, though. Exotic Deer trying to move forward. The double gank, Slimming Crush. We'll connect on the bear, but not insane. They go under the tower, chase forward with Spirit Lance. Insania. Looks like he will fall under his tower. An exotic deer still tanky enough to keep chasing Quick, but might be a drop. Cattle comes across as well. They've got the Frostbite Bell to use it after the fear's been thrown out. Exotic get low. The cold snap coming out. Looks like they might have to trade. The fissure though, Quick is still alive. Pathos! He'll find him in the end, but now he's surrounded. He has no way out in Tatsor. He might die as well. Tiger trying to chase one. Nice livery and crush. Pathos. Maybe he makes his escape the chop through. Mickey gets a double kill. And Tiger. He's got arcanes. He can get the fissure block. He just yeah, needs to get the right positioning. Sun strike, basically. And pop. Oh no! He sidestepped at Cantor. Is he trapped in here though? No, there's enough room to move around the fissure. Invoker's but guess what? Invoker's still coming. Mikke wants to finish this kill. Cold snap coming out. One, two, and thank you. It's He's got the egg available. Patos needs to back up entirely. They're going to TP in the Wish Doctor. Nisha's here as well. They're just having the bear casually push on the tower. But it's taking a lot of damage. Now they jump in the cool oh, on two. Box is good. The meatball follow up as well. Patos with the fish as well. They can't do anything. The death coming up for Elfast. But they get the supernova down. The chop through interrupting. And can they get the egg in time? Sequence? Nisha forced to retreat here. Oh, Elisash. He hits it. He lives. But guess what? Echo slam for Nisha. He won't be so like They move forward to find the dun. And the dun. They get four for one. They already have these two blink daggers. Oh, put on my going on Boxy here, but Insania's nearby. They don't want to stack too hard. The freezer field coming out as well. Insania soaring in. Oh, they stun him. No. Patience from Patos and it pays off. And now Boxy, he can't get out the frostbite. He's going to give the TP. Patos, slivery and crush coming up. Corner. No, Boxy. Oh, he turns ball. around. He says, fine. You want to stun me up, you can die. But he will die in return. As the Malady does way too much damage. They're jumping for Tiger in return. Can they get a corner? Cattle is going to be close with the hunger. But nice save with the voodoo from Elisash. Which doctor moving in, planting that sentry. Oh, just off the mark. Does not see the ward. EK needs to be careful. He was coming out. Tiger going to interrupt the LSA there. They saw it. Insania, egg goes down, and now the tornado through trying to buy time for the to pop. Tiger could control, but it won't matter. The Laguna going into Mikke as well. They'll find two kills already. And Tiger on the side. He can't escape as they break the trees. They surround him from all sides. They'll uh, kill him off the back. jump in. No, he gets stunned as he tries to use the call. Boxy. He's going to fall as well. A little bit too late to the fight there. Kiting, he's trying man. to go. Exotic D just, just in the trees like, please do not spin. And the hoi hoi, here's the bear. Also now the glyph already. The sun is going to keep it to full HP more or less. Rush just coming in from Patos, which means he can't initiate on the back line right now. But the bear, 
Yeah. He's definitely gone. They jump in there. They call straight on top of Cat. So trying to kill him with the Sun Strike is good enough. The dunk from Boxy clean up the kill. They do the bear, but they'll instantly resummon with the cap on the high ground as well. Patos has to slow us down. The Sliver and Crush coming in. But guess what? It's not the bear you have to worry about. It's the catapult this time. Here we go. As she has no mana, like 50%. Oh, they're going to back away. The bear might not be so like the Sun Ray. Trying to help him out. The Spirit Vessel is doing a lot of work against this, though. And it looks like that bear yeah, is going to pop. But there goes Slab coming in. Tiger on the back foot and the supernova down. Nisha, the chop through the find. And the buyback can't see him. Maybe a little bit too late. Slardar's going to commit as well. But you just open up the high ground because you committed so hard on that bear. PL's going to TP back now. The Meeple coming down with the call in. It misses. Exotic Deer moves forward too quick. The Blade Mail is out in the box. They don't want to find right now. The Sunray going straight on the top of Exotic Deer. But now the Death Force down. Boxy in a lot of trouble. Hiding in the corner. Please don't kill me. He's got the call available. He'll throw it out. Nope. Gets stunned up and slivery, crushed the exotic deer, falls the tiger on the other side of the fight, the ice wall, trapping in and separating the fight and without the PL there. That's it. Tiger. They want to go on him so bad, but they can't. Oh, Boyk far. Jump in. Shows at the creep wave. They jump in, slivery crush coming out, and now Invoker moves too far away. The tornado through is not gonna connect. Now Mike, he's shown himself in the fight. The Laguna going out, the coif is gonna fall. Mike revealed the call from box is good, but is it good enough? Pat on the echo slam! Cool. And the egg as well! They'll hit it up. Nisha should take a lot of damage as he's moving away. The BKB coming out. Can he get out of this? No, he gets stunned up. Tiger has to retreat in return. But he will get a stun. Looks like he's going out of Sash, but he's too tanky with the Voodoo Restoration. The Sun around the other side of the fight. Exotic Deer forced to run away by Boxy. But the dunk, he'll get one. He wants more, though. Can he move quick enough is going to be the question. El Sash, he'll be able to escape. Exotic Deer healing up with the heart. He wants to re engage in Sane. a little bit of trouble. Cancel creates his face. Oh, the call coming out. It's good. It's fire space with the blade mail. Exotic Deer, it won't matter. He'll go for the back line. Insania a little bit of trouble. The buyback coming out from the Shaker, but he's so far away. They'll lose Insania. Tiger trying to get across in time to save Boxy, but it may be Lou too little, too late. He'll proc out to the Maledict and they'll the ping on to well. Tiger as well. He can still cancel his ult TP. Oh, oh, stun oh, coming in. They're going to quick for first. The light striker as well. The BKB, the call coming out of the blade mail. Elndis is proc straight away. Lena needs to be careful here. Needs to held in place. Has to retreat. But gets more. Slada will be the castle with the BKB. They'll get rid of the egg. Chase on the back line. Quick for a little bit of trouble. There's the freezer field coming out. The bear trying to move away. Quick for a little bit of trouble. Getting across the top of this hill. But Mike on the back foot trying to do some work. But they just dodge out the snowball. Jumping by Tiger. Fish it down. Trying to be the castle. One more hit. Need to find it. El is going to fall as well. Mike just trying to take on this fight. But exotic deer. He is the true threat to everyone here. Mike is forced to just run away. Yeah, the Invoker is kind of running low too, right? Oh, yeah, Slavery so Crush, as you go in. BKB resorted here. Jumps around the boxy. The freezing field as well. The Laguna just to blow up that axe. And now Mike trying to turn around the tornado in the ice wall. But they just need to retreat off the back of this thing. I'm going to hit him up the route. Yes. Mike needs to escape. The BKB got the Echo Slam on the back foot. Tiger and the Supernova down as well. Patos, he's going to get picked off. Exotic Deer to start control. They'll get rid of the egg. Nish is low on HP. The BKB protects him. He's chasing through on the Tiger. Can they actually get this? Tiger can't move away quick enough. Stun's trying to create that space, but Nisha sees him perfectly. And Mike, they're chasing onto him as well. Quick for going to try for the TP out. Light Striker Ray interrupts at the bear. Trying to chase down Nisha in return. The Shadow Blade gets forced out, and the roots come out. He fights That's with all. Cattle. But no, the Sun Striker Ray won't connect. And they will still lose Quake for four for one in the end. And they hold, but look at the bot lane. They lost the tier four. Alliance has the high ground, and they actually benefit. Oh, they're going in. Oh, Hex comes Hex out, though. They find it straight away. The bear's going to be controlled up. Boxy with the yours as well. He needs to get out quick. The meeple coming out. The freeze field's there. Mikke's own BKB means he doesn't care about it. They're going to oh, slide out. Get on HP. This time they'll kill him off the Devil Blast. Now the Echo Slam on the back foot. Cats on the level. The Cataclysm as well. Not perfectly timed. The Elend is still protected. Now the Egg going down. It looks like they're going to be having some omelette because two heroes already done on Alliance. An exotic deer chase of a more. Mikke needs to move away. So no nullifiers. Very oh, hard to get. They smoked up. Mikke oh. gets Hex straight away. The BKB and Cats are moving in. They'll just lagoon him down. Now the Slivery and Crush. Koi forgets found as well. And Boxy on the back foot needs to run away. The Yule's coming out. When he comes down though, what's he going to do? The BKB up trying to move away, but the right clicks hit pretty hard right now. Cats all just waiting nearby trying to get closed up with the call, but they'll find it. Him. Double kill for Nisha. They get three important kills. There's creeps pushing again. Katzel has to respond to this. A little Sasha oh, there as Tiger. well. They might notice. Oh, they find Earthshaker though. What is he doing outside the base? Tiger makes a mistake. The Light Striker right down. He just disappears. Or he's summoned on the bear. If he dies, it's going to be... Light Striker right here's the bear. A jump in. Cool coming out from Box and Sun Strike as well. They trigger out the air on Disco Nisha. But now the BKB on Koi, but they've stacked them up for the Sun Ray. But now the Yule's on to the Slider. Try and protect the Pathos. Trying to move away. Getting low, but now Exotic did. Can he actually do enough work here? If he gets the bear, this could be over. 
Mike trying to move away. Will be able to retreat, but now what do you do to defend? The Echo Slam on the back foot. Hitting on the two. Nisha, the egg down as well. Can they do enough? They eat the cheese. The look at the fight. The supernova just countered by the CM alone. And now the frostbite coming out. The buyback's being used. They need to defend this. They can't afford this right now. Exotic did going in even deeper. They still haven't got rid of this Aegis yet. On the other side of the fight, the Samurai coming down to cancel. He doesn't care. The Elden is finally running out. The frostbite down to Mike. If he dies, he's fine with this because Exotic Deer is just running a mock in their base. Next to his team, so they can just secure these racks. They don't need to get too aggressive. Tiger, no Echo Slam for 30. Can they do anything? The X coming the out. What are they going to do? This is the re crush on the Mike. He's controlled up. The Light Striker as well. They're getting rid of him. No and on the other back. side, they're going to lose. Insane as well. No buyback. And it's GG by the looks of it. Because there's no way they can hold with Koifa alone. It's going to be 2 0 for new guys. They'll finish it off by killing off Koifa. But that's going to be it. What can he do versus them? Oh, oh the Hex as well. Boxy, he yeah, won't even get a chance. He's a cool. Maybe, maybe. That the Echo Slap coming in. It's big. But the all straight away. They'll find the kill. And that was their last hope. GG. You hoped, you saw a huge echo, maybe there's a chance, but at this stage in the game, when the squishiest individual has 2000 HP,